Okay, so you're going to be really impressed. This is something that you had talked to me about, and I told you that I would build it for you, but I actually found out it's possible today. So I wanted to make a video. I'm going to share it with everybody, but you know it's for you, and you know who you are. So you wanted a way to use the LLMs in order to translate an, an, an annotation, so an annotation from like a chess tournament, you want to translate that annotation into a PGN file because we all know that after a, after a match, we want to take it back, bring it into our computers, and analyze it. So I found a picture of a tournament match annotated by Tal himself. And I went back in time that far because in those days, I found people's handwriting was just better. I don't know whether school was better in these days or what, but they wrote a lot neater. But they didn't write the same way. Notice this says pawn to Q4. Pawn takes pawn. We don't actually write like that anymore. But I figured let's go ahead and give it a try, even though it really isn't a modern annotation. It's an older annotation. So after I saved the image onto my computer, I went to ChatGPT. Now I am leveraging ChatGPT 4, but you can do this with 3.5 as well. It may not be as awesome, but I'm using ChatGPT 4. And basically what I'm saying here is I'm giving a prompt to ChatGPT so that it knows that this is an annotation from a chess match and that I want it to end up with some code that's a PGN that I can import into Lychus. Now, what happens to me sometime when I'm prompting is I will start typing, and for some reason, if I hit my mouse or something, because you should see the angle that I'm at this computer. This is a computer that's in the corner of my room. It's not my work computer. So sometimes I mess up. So in this case, when I type this prompt, I also copied it just in case something went wrong. Then I went to my computer and I went to the desktop and I got that file. I, so I took Tal's file, saved it as a picture to my desktop, and then I put it on, to, uh, I uploaded it with the prompt. FYI, by the way, um, what's very interesting about this is you can just take a picture with your phone. You don't need to do anything special with these images. They do not have to be OCR'd. Just take a picture with your phone of your match, and then it will do it. Sometimes you'll have to manually scroll down. Okay, it depends on how much zoom you have. And you can see it's converted this. Now, this is something very exciting that I learned in doing this for you. I want you to look that move one is E4 by white, C5 by black. Let's take a really close look at what the sheet itself says it says first move was pawn to king four second move well first move for black was pawn to queen bishop four that's how we used to write this yet even though it wrote it in that because i used the word modern in my prompt it actually made this modern annotation. So first it went and modernized the annotation. So it went uh, move by move and it is checking the moves to make sure that they're possible, by the way. I've tried to fool it, right? And now I'm going to show you, after you get that, it will go ahead and give us the literal code for the PGN file. And what's nice about this is you just have this little button on the top right called copy code, and you can use that copy code button to bring it into Lychus. So um, first big amazing thing is the modernization of the, of the code, but then you in the top right corner, copy code, you copy that, and then you run over to Lychus. And from lychess.org, you go into import again a, uh, a match now mine is in French but yours will be in English and then you paste what you copied and import it and now Tal's game is here in Lychess with me 
which means I can create studies on it, I can analyze it, I can check the book against modern masters as to what they would do. All of that is possible in just a few clicks. Take a picture, write the prompt, import the photo, and all the rest is done for you, even if you're using old annotations. So I just had to show you this because it really shows the power of modern day LLM. And when you combine that with image recognition and sound recognition, you get amazing experiences. So anyway, I just wanted to share this. It has nothing to do with you know my life. It was your idea, and I just wanted to show you.